yes children in this chapter we are reading about property of metals and non metal there is an activity shown here where you are seeing that there is a circuit shown and the circuit is connected by a wire and there is a battery so this is the battery and there is a wire and this is a a metal nail shown here there is a bulb connected here and these are the wires so the battery produces the current the bulb is used for lighting up the wire is used for conducting the current and the nail is used for checking which substance allows current to pass through it if we connect the wire with the nail the bulb will light up if we change the nail and use other substance the bulb will light up like if you use any other you all of you must be knowing which substance will allow the bulb to light up so the different substances will behave in a different way we will read and note down the results in a table